are the Problem-Based Academy of Critical Thinking, what we'd like to do is a lot of hands-on for our students. So we do problem-based learning, where basically we give a kid the problem and say, hey, solve it. Now, there's a, it's a little more that goes into that, but what we like to do is to make these things a lot more relevant and the kids are not just memorizing information, but the things that they're, they're learning, they're applying it to a real-life problem. Instead of just like going through textbooks or boring PowerPoints, we get to experience it. Like they'll set a whole thing up for us or we have to make it ourselves. It's helped me with communication and being open to talking to people because before I was like really shy and didn't talk. But now I can go up to a new student and introduce myself and show them around and stuff. What we're trying to do is we're trying to personalize the learning by, by really getting to understand what exactly it is that our students are missing. A lot of our students or some of our students walk in the door and they have some things that they need to focus on in order to be successful on the high school level. So we figure out what those things are and we have something called our impact time. That's the time during the day where we focus on what students need, whether it is just focusing on a specific area or their IEP goals or just kind of pushing them forward. Compared to other schools, in this school you have a voice. The teacher actually, your opinion actually matters, and that's a big factor where you come from. Because before I wasn't really heard and misunderstood, but here they actually listen to me. A lot of our field trips are really based on what kids are saying they're interested in. Instead of just kind of doing the, hey, we're all going to the zoo type of field trip, we, we try to personalize it. Kids who are interested in the medical field, we actually have a partnership with uh, Ohio University Medical School where kids were involved in a hands-on piece for our 11th grader. Uh, and also lawyers, kids who want to become lawyers or want to go into engineering, we try to personalize our field trip based on what kids are saying that they need. They actually set up a meeting or interview with an actual lawyer, and a famous lawyer. And I got to talk to him, he told me about his cases, he told me how you prepare for it, how you, how you need to prepare your speech. We get to start a new clubs if we want to, like I'm on the leadership team with Mr. Reynolds and like we talk to other students in our school to see what they're interested in and what clubs they want to start or like if they want to dress down day. We are a resource here. If you need anything from us, we welcome you in. The doors are always open for students, for parents, for the community to come on in. Uh, and we are out there as well. So we've been doing some community service out there. I believe that we are very much so a part of the community. So we want to do our best to stay a part of the community. It's a very good school. And if you can come, I, I highly recommend it because it's really changed my life around.